The infinity that you're talking about, is that the infinity that you went to the Atlanta airport with Thug when he rented the infinity? What you, what you, what you asking? You're talking about an infinity that you gave the threat, correct? Right. The infinity that you're referring to, is that the infinity that you went to the Atlanta airport with Thug when he rented the infinity? Yes. Okay. And that was the car that Thug rented, correct? I asked him to rent, rent me a car, and I rented the car, and I gave the car the threat. When did you give the car the threat? The same night I rented it. The, the night before that happened. Before what happened? Uh, the same night it happened. I, I can't remember. I gave, it, I gave the car the threat, and I left. Where did you give the car the threat at? At the studio. What studio? I pulled up and gave it to him and pulled it right off. What studio? Um, it was by Northside Drive, Marietta. It was, it was one of them streets. Was there anyone else at the studio when you gave the we car? Didn't, I, didn't, I didn't go in the studio. I pulled up. I was pulling up, and I seen Threat. I, I gave Threat the car, jumped out of the car. It got in my charge. I mean, uh, called my brother to come and get me in. And was this the day Donovan Thomas died? Was this a few days before? In relation to when Donovan Thomas died, when did you get threat this vehicle? I gave threat that car. He let, like, I, I wrecked the car, I gave it a threat. So when you wrecked the car, why would you give threat a wrecked vehicle? So I could, <laughs> what you mean? I, it wasn't damaged bad. I just, I don't know. I I, I hit I hit some on the and then shit. I, the thing the thing on the cover it was tripping. So when I pulled up, I went giving it to threat, but I just seen him standing outside. And I was like, he like, what you about to do? I'm like, him just get the key real quick. I'll be right back. Gave threat the car and I dip. I don't know if it was then it was late. So when I woke up the next day, I came outside and this when I heard what happened. Okay. I just tell him this is a time to yes, for the day. Stop. All right. Yes. So the video y'all just watched was a video of YSL Woody's first day back in court giving his testimony. And he's telling the prosecution about a situation that happened the night of or the night before Big Nut was murdered. Now, the guy name he keep mentioning in this is his deceased friend. He keeps saying this guy Threat is who he gave the infinity to. Uh, Threat is also known as Tay. Tay is the guy that lost his life. Rest in peace to Tay. Um, a lot of people saying that, hey, man, that was a message sent to YSL Woody to, you know, you better not do what you about to do on that stand, bro. So a lot of people saying that's connected to that. But basically what I took away from this is YSL Woody is stuttering a bit. He's giving them information that maybe he shouldn't be giving them. And I, although maybe he thinks he's helping Thug, ultimately this may come back to bite Young Thug and YSL Woody later. He's basically giving them clues to the murder. In a way, bro, like, this is kind of crazy, man. Um, What do you guys think about this video? What did you guys gather from watching it? That was my take on it. Um, I just think he's giving away too many things that's going to connect something later on in the case. Like, he's talking about the infinity that Thug rented to kill. Like, bro, this is getting crazy. What do you guys think, though? I want y'all to drop a comment, man. Make sure you like and subscribe to stay up to date with all the YSL news. I'm going to try to definitely cover it day to day for y'all, man. Um... Yeah, man. Thank y'all for watching, man. Rap goats. Let's get it. It's busy. Rap goats. Rap goats. Rap goats. Rap goats. Yeah.